60 years ago today, a major development in the history of civil rights in America. Four African-American North Carolina teenagers chose to make a difference, taking a stand by sitting down at a lunch counter. That story and more can be found inside Atlanta's Apex Museum. Here's CBS 46's Haley Mason. The African American Panoramic Experience, or Apex Museum, is an important resource devoted to African American history. Founded by Dan Moore Sr., it's shared its vision since 1978 from its location on historic Auburn Avenue. Its mission to interpret and present history from an African American perspective, the museum showcases artifacts, photographs, exhibits, as well as offers shows, programs, and presentations, all related to African American culture, not only from the past, but the present as well. There's the history of many firsts on display throughout the complex, as well as the many images of segregation, not only in Atlanta, Atlanta and the South, but across the country. Like the February 1st, 1960 sit-in protest by four North Carolina a and students at a whites-only counter in Greensboro. A movement that spread to dozens of locations, thousands of protesters across 13 states. Just to imagine me not being able to go somewhere, me not being able to do certain things just because of my race. The museum's permanent exhibits range from Africa, the untold story, to work by W.E.B. Du Bois, the African Holocaust during the transatlantic slave trade, and Sweet Auburn, Sweet Pride, where you can see a replica of the Yates and Milton Drugstore, one of Atlanta's first black-owned businesses, as well as many other African-American pioneers. The Apex Museum has been a touchstone for more than four decades, serving the Metro Atlanta community helping Atlantans, all Americans, and international visitors better understand and appreciate the contributions of African Americans to America and the world.